Hi everyone, it's Gemma. Welcome back to my channel and a new video. As you've probably seen from the title, this video is all about spring accessories and I'm going to show you five of the accessory trends for this season and I've got loads of finds from the high street to show you as well. Now, updating your accessories is a really easy way and let's face it, more affordable way of keeping your wardrobe looking fresh. Just by adding an on-trend bag or a new style of sunglasses can completely update your look. So if you're new here, welcome. My name's Gemma, as I said before. I post fashion videos a couple of times a week. And if that interests you, then I would love for you to hit this subscribe button down below. So let's get started on the first trend. Now, if you've been shopping online or you've been into the stores, you'll have seen that crossbody bags are everywhere. They come in all shapes and sizes and colors. But the great thing about them is they're practical, a practical bag for change. Can you believe it? The first one I found is this gorgeous one from Zara, black crossbody bag. It's got a quilted exterior with these little studs, obviously has that kind of Chanel feel to it, but really beautiful, very elegant and simple. Then I next found this blue one from River Island. Love the colour of this, just such a colour pop. It's a great shape and looks like you could fit quite a lot into it as well and it's only £28. Then I saw this really beautiful pink one from Ted Baker. It's a little bit expensive, £140, but it is very, very beautiful. And the great thing about this bag, the strap is removable, so you can also use it as a clutch. I thought this one was really pretty, love the embroidery detail, such a lovely colour as well. And if you've got quite a plain outfit on, this bag will just completely transform your outfit. I love the colour of this bag, obviously pastels being so on trend this season. If you didn't want to wear lilac clothing, then this bag could be the ideal solution. It looks quite big and it looks like you could fit quite a lot in it. I just love the pastel tones to it. And then I found this gorgeous bag from Zara, which I absolutely love. Love the shape of it. It's a great colour for the spring and just a gorgeous bag. And I just wanted to add this one in because I just thought it was so beautiful. It is expensive, but there's no harm in admiring it. Simple, but very elegant. Now, the second trend we're going to talk about is ear bling. Statement earrings have been around for the last few seasons, but this season it's all about the bling. The sparklier, the bigger, the better. So we're talking kind of chandelier style earrings. This may not be a trend for you, but I'm really happy about this. I love anything sparkly. Now, these are the ones that I found on the high street. First up are these ones from ASOS. They've got a gold tone finish in a teardrop design and they're just £12. Then I found these ones. Now these are only £8. They're currently in the sale. It's difficult to see from the picture quite how big they are, but they're certainly sparkly. These are a little bit more pricey, but if you wanted to spend a bit more, these are quite beautiful. They're £121, but look really gorgeous. These earrings have a rose gold tone. They've got the drop design and they're only £14. And I really love the design of these with the little floral design at the top with the drop statement diamantes. I thought they were very pretty and I had to throw these in there. Not really chandelier, but they're big and very sparkly, expensive too. But if you wanted to do this trend in style, these are the earrings for you. The third spring accessory trend is straw bags. And it's a trend that you're gonna to wanna to invest in now before all the good ones go. I found some really nice straw bags on the high street. Now, the first one that I found is this one. I love the pom-poms on this bag and I think the shape of the bag is really nice as well. This one's 79.84 and you can actually get the pom-poms in different colors. Now, I've got quite a few straw bags to show you, so I'm gonna whiz through them all because I got a bit carried away. There's so many lovely bags out there. This one is a circular bag. It's a great shape and it's perfect for sunny holidays, but also for day-to-day -day use as well. And it's 60 pounds. So I really like that one. This one I'd say is a little bit more casual if you just want to keep it a little bit more simple. It's only 22 pounds and definitely more a day-to-day -day bag. I love the colors of this bag, just kind of breaks up the straw color. It's by Rebecca Minkoff. It is 139 pounds, but it's a fabulous looking bag. I thought the shape of this one was really nice. I love the contrast stripe and it's just £25. Here's another pom-pom bag. I love the two-tone colours and it's also lined inside as well, so that's really good. Another circular bag. This was a great price, £24. It comes from Topshop. It also has a strap as well. 
And there's this little one. I always save the expensive ones to last. This one's £210, but how pretty is this bag? Love the shape, love all the pom-pom details and the tassels as well. Just love this bag. Now the fourth spring accessory trend is hats. And in particular, the Baker Boy hat and also the beret. Now, hats may not be your thing, but it's definitely worth having a try. You never know, this style might suit you. But if you don't think either of those are for you, the wide brim hat is still fashionable as well. Now, these are the ones that I found from the high street. I love the colour of this one. It's from River Island. It's £18. It looks a really nice shape and quite nice quality. This one's beautiful, but it's really expensive. It's navy blue in velvet and looks very luxurious. This is just a nice alternative to plain black or tan. It's in a checked fabric, it's £12.99 and just nice as an alternative. Another Baker Boy hat in a really nice colour. It's a great price, £14.90 and another nice alternative to a plain black cap. Now I found this beret, it's £10, it's grey, and looks really cute and I love this one because of the pearl detail I thought it was really nice and unusual it's £17.95 does also come in some other colours as well it comes in a grey and red I think then I've just got a couple of wide rim hats to show you this one I saw in Dorothy Perkins plain white with a nice navy blue band it's just £10 I did see it in the store it looks quite nice this one's from Zara I really love this one I've seen this so many times it's plain black, it's got a very wide rim, but will go with so many things. And you've probably seen lots of this style of hat. This one says, do not disturb. It's a gorgeous summer's hat. It's very expensive, but I just wanted to put that in there to show you. So the fifth and final spring accessory trend is bum bags, or fanny packs is what I think you call them in America. I think this is a trend you're either going to love or you're going to hate. Initially, I wasn't keen on it, but I have since seen some pictures on Instagram and Pinterest, and you can actually make this look look a little bit more elegant and a little bit more classy rather than that kind of sports luxe look. So take a look at some of the things that I found online. So the first one is this. This gorgeous little bag is from Kate Spade. It's not cheap, it's £178, but it does look very, very pretty. And because of the colour of it, it'll go with anything. But if you didn't want to wear it as a belt bag, you can also sling it over your shoulder as well, so that's really good. I thought this one looked really cute. It's in orange, and it also has a shoulder strap as well. And it's £23, so if you wanted to try the trend, you're not going to break the bank. It looks nice and simple, not too fussy. Comes in a couple of colours. And it's a really good price as well. Now the creme de la creme, I've left this one to last as it's so beautiful. This one's from Chloe. As you can expect, it's expensive, but I just wanted to admire the beauty of this bag. I love everything about this bag. It does come in a couple of colours, but I think the colour I would go for is the, is the neutral shade. But it is beautiful, so let's just take a moment to admire it. So thanks for watching everyone, please give this video a thumbs up if you like this video and hit subscribe if you haven't done already. Let me know below of any spring accessory trends that you're going to be trying or you're definitely not going to be trying. And take care and I'll see you again soon. Bye.